I'm sorry if you can see my nipples through this top. I really want to wear it because it's really cute and I never really wear it. Um, but I think maybe that's why I don't wear it because you can see nip. Sorry. So we'll have to just get over it. Okay? Hi! Welcome into another video. We're here. We're sitting down for episode two of Wednesday. Guys, just so you know, if you weren't on that live, I did do a live today and kind of like spoke about Wednesday. Um, the Wednesday videos are going to be coming sooner than I anticipated because I basically want to finish this season before we get to Christmas slash New Year. Um, so I'm going to try and get them up as quick as possible. Um, no promises, but that's kind of where I'm at. Okay, so don't come for me if I don't manage it, but I'm going to try. Okay, but anyway, we're here. We're sitting down for episode two. The title is, Where is the Loneliest Number? That means nothing to me. Um, I'm excited. I really enjoyed the first episode. Thanks for the love on the first episode. That video's done really well. I think currently it's at like 90k or something crazy. So thanks for the love on the, on the first app. With all that said, let's get into it. Check me out on Instagram, it'll be up on the screen there. Check me out on Spotify, Twitter, Patreon, Discord, all linked down below. Thanks to my pre-existing patrons, that's we know that thanks to the channel, it really does mean the world. The unedited versions of these go up on Patreon before you see them on YouTube, so if you want to be the first to see them and in their full unedited entirety, then do check out the Patreon. Um, and I think that's it. I think that's everything. Okay, let's get into it. Okay, Wednesday, baby. What have we got in store? Oh, a Netflix series. That's new. Was that in the first episode? This story is about to take a dark turn. Like it wasn't dark already. You think we missed something? I say we double back, sweep Collet Creek, and then call it a night. So are they looking for this werewolf thing? But I don't even know if it was a werewolf, guys. It didn't look like a werewolf, did it? How could you miss a dead body? Because it wasn't there. No footprints, no blood, no sign of a struggle, nothing. Nada. Oh! Did you get a good look at this monster thing? It didn't stick around for a chat. Maybe it was one of your classmates. Oh my god, yeah, wait, guys, it could it could be a student, couldn't it? Because, I mean, we have werewolves and thingies. Like, who knows? Maybe we have a werewolf. My guess is run, run away. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe it's a human that can transform. And just to be clear, this monster wasn't a bear or some other wild animal? No, no, it wasn't a bear. I've hibernated with grizzlies. I'm shocked! This is shocking news! I know the difference. It looked weird. It looked almost cartoony. I would like to speak to Sheriff Galpin. Alone. I'm not sure I can allow that. I love that fireplace. That is sickening. <laughs> Play nice. Or I will call the man. I'm sorry, but red is not the colour for her. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop going for the, the makeup choice as I am, but Do you and I both know that there's a monster out there? And Rowan is his latest victim. Hun, listen to her. She but she she agrees with what he said. He said that the mayor thinks it's a bear. He doesn't. to have to put on my fucking double seeing glasses what believe nothing you hear and half of what you see how is he alive well <laughs> how is rowan alive that's what i would like to know unless he can't be killed because i mean he was magical wasn't he fucking <laughs> I'm here to help you process your emotions. The emotions are a gateway trait. I can't believe Rowan's alive. I reckon he just can't die. Have you considered your antisocial tendencies might be motivated by fear of rejection? If you were to reject me right now, I would not be upset. <laughs> she don't want her help. Oh, my battery's dying, the fuck? Okay, be happy. Hey, you know, when you ran off last night at the Harvest Festival, I wasn't sure what happened. And then I heard. Yeah, why did why did he not follow her? The fuck? Because they weren't they weren't like far apart, were they? You know, for the record, I believe you. Oh, what a lovely guy! I don't, guys, I'm not gonna lie. I think I do fancy him a little bit. You mean Rowan? I witnessed his murder, Enid. It's just we all saw him this morning. 
very much like not dead. I'm sorry. You all go to a magical school with magical beings. It's not far off to think that um, one of these magical beings maybe can't die. Or maybe it's a zombie or something. Right? Like that doesn't seem like a crazy concept, does it? What is the poke up anyway? Only my entire reason for living right now. No rules. <sighs> She's a lot, isn't she? She's very <laughs> in your face. Ma! Or you can just lay uncomfortably. Whatever works for you. I'm sorry, I kind of think that Enid might be a little bit... And I would not be mad. We love lesbian, you queer thing. But I guess not everything can be gay, even though it should be. What were you doing out in the woods with him in the first place? I told you already. I heard a noise and I went to investigate. He was trying to kill me, babes. He had me up in a tree. You had a psychic vision, didn't you? Yeah. Your mother started having visions around your age. They were notoriously unreliable. Well, hers are pretty spot on, aren't they? Gaslight, gatekeep, girl boss. May I go now? Not until you've picked your extracurricular activity. Gymnastics, please. I would love to do gymnastics at school, but my school didn't allow it. No doubt you'll find something that tickles your fancy. The last person who tickled me lost a finger. <laughs> I mean, fair play, to be honest. No one should tickle anybody, un like, <laughs> unprovoked. Do you know what I mean? Keep an eye on Roman. Don't let your fingers out of his sight. Think, think freaks me out. It really does. After I passed out, who did you tell? The sheriff? You think I trust normie cops? She is beautiful, I'm sorry. Bianca might be a bitch, but she's fucking gorge. What are you? Alto, soprano, or just loco? <laughs> Shut up, Bianca! Hey? Hey, what's cracking here? What was that? A note only dogs can hear. Slay! Fuck your whistle notes. Here's a little song I wrote. You might want to sing in open notes. Is this Bianca? This is some choir. Guys, I will say, what if it's him? He's always alone. Lone wolf. Like, what's this judge? Has he got a power? Do we know about it? She can do everything. Like, seriously. She was great at fencing, if you could call it that. Sword fighting, whatever, right? She obviously can do tricks because she did an aerial. She, she hit a note only dogs can hear, so she's a fucking vocalist. And now she can do archery. I just went into the woods to clear my head. Then you came after me. What? Shut the fuck up. Don't make, don't make me think I'm crazy, twatted. Do you know, I really liked him as well. Come on, thing. Doing the damn thing. <laughs> Oh, okay. Like no one's gonna notice a fucking rogue hand scuttling its way. Uh. What? What the fuck? It's not. Ro Wait, is it not Rowan? What if that's the way? What if that's the wall? Because I feel like because the police obviously never never found it and like have, have like scoped the whole thing, surely it has to be able to like morph into other things because realistically it didn't look like a normal wolf, right? So what if that's the... Him! What? Excuse me, sir. I'm confused. I'm confused. So who is it? Is it her? We don't fucking know, do we? That's sadistic. There's an open spot next to me. What was Bianca's face like that for?
I doubt Wednesday is impressed by your tricks. I'm, I'm very impressed. That is a big fat slave. You have, now, now it can stay fucking where it is. Wednesday, we're thrilled to have you join us. That, I'm sorry, that is sickening. That would be my power. I love to draw, I love to paint, and if I could make them come to life, that is sickening. Who can tell us the name of this beauty? Dendrophylax and Denii. Otherwise known as the ghost orchid. First discovered on the Isle of Wight in 1854. Guys, she knows everything. She knows and can do everything. I'm so confused by her. Looks like you may have competition for first chair, Bianca. <laughs> Fuck you, Bianca. Barclay. It's like Boucle, isn't it? Thanks, Tyler. Thank you. Thank you, hun. Saving me from your dad, but why are you here? I assume your father didn't bring the bloodhound to play fetch. You must think it's weird. I'm stalking him. Oh, he's following his dad. So, so you really saw it? Well, yeah, it looked right fucking at us. It actually saved me from Rowan. That's the part I'm trying to figure out. I'm telling you, he's protecting her for some reason. I came out here to find something that can prove he was murdered and that I haven't lost my mind. Rowan's fucking glasses. That's for all the naysayers out there. He really did die. I'm confused, that's confused me. I'm confused by that vision. It was a very long one. I tell you what, they're getting lengthier, aren't they? Lengthier and lengthier, she says. Have you seen this before? It's a watermark from a book I'm looking for. I think it's the symbol to an old student society. Color me intrigued. <laughs> I love me intrigued. <laughs> Honestly, guys, the writing is phenomenal. Whoever wrote, wrote or like scripted this shit, they deserve a prize. I've been here a year and a half, and I still feel like an outsider. Is that because you're the only normie on the staff? Oh, she's a normal person. Why is she here, then? I thought Nevermore would be different, but there's still a handful of teachers who will barely acknowledge me. God, that's just fucking rude. Rude. Are you kidding me? We're not kids anymore. Do you know what I mean? Let's stop. Let's stop acting like them. And if you ever need anyone to talk to, the door to the conservatory is always open. And she's a plant girly. Me and her are gonna get along. I love plants. He's weird to me, guys. I wonder why him and Rowan are arguing. That might be motive for him to kill Rowan, if you ask me. But his power's doing this, right? Bringing things out of his drawings, whatnot. Doesn't say werewolf to me. Okay. Oh, he's drawn her and it's good. Guys, he's drawn her and it's good. I reckon they might be um, using him as like a decoy. I don't. I reckon it'd be, it's too easy for it to be him or like anything to do with him. The fuck, the fuck, the fuck, the fuck. Rowan's full of surprises. Oh, that was Rowan's. Ah, so Rowan was obviously a part of this group of people. <laughs> why is Bianca there? You were the one who was afraid he would do something to Wednesday. Isn't that why you've been following her around like an eager-eyed puppy? Or is there something more? Ah, so did he know that um, Rowan had a gripe with Wednesday? Seriously, what do you see in her? She's jealous of Wednesday. I reckon she likes him. Oh, honey. Oh, oh, honey. <laughs> I make one mistake and you can't forgive me. She treats you like crap and you can't get enough. Okay, why are you so fixated on Wednesday? Because she thinks she's better than everyone else. The pot calls the kettle black. Come on, hon. You think you're better than everybody else. I can't wait to crush Ophelia Hall tomorrow and watch her werewolf roommate crumble. Yeah, and you wonder why I broke up with you. Oh, guys are a thing. Wednesday Adams is not the girl of your dreams. Why? What, what have you got against Wednesday? She's not really doing anything to you other than give you a run for your fucking money. OMG, you look perfect. She looks sickening. That's sickening. Oh, it's great. I'm here for the costume. I really am. I'm, he I'm here for the full fantasy. For the record, I don't believe I'm better than everyone else. Just that I'm better than you. She fucking heard you, huh? 
<laughs> oh, I love that. 25 years. Boring. Darling. Next. You know Let the poo cup begin. <laughs> Come on, Bebel. You see that, Bebel? This is the, I'm sorry, but this is happening in plain sight. Like, there's no, there's no there's secret. No secret. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I, I've got, I've got no choice but to stand. His majestic is fit, and he's got a tail, a long one. <laughs> oh my god, that is so dangerous. Bianca is doing shit. Oh, the, the foul play, I cannot. <laughs> See, but that's, that's gotta feel shit though, you've gotta cheat to win. Like, that doesn't mean that you're good. Anyway. Yeah, she's fucking seen him. This is what I mean. They're hardly doing this secretly, are they? <laughs> they fucking installed a net to catch the hoe. I'm sorry, but that is so sexy. Merman. I know it's not a merman, it's a siren, but that's still fucking cool. Stay here and make sure Bianca can't sabotage her boat. Thing? I need you to distract a couple of jokers. Well, yeah, we may as well play fucking fair and square, do you know what I mean? <laughs> I love when things flips, pe flips people off. That is so funny. Let's go. We're all sabotaging each other. Oh, we're having a vision. Shit. Shit! Not the time, huh? Not the time. We need to win this race. Well, she looks great in that costume. Who is that? Is that her? You are the key. You are the key. What does it mean? What does it mean? Taking a cat nap? <laughs> Fuck! Game over. The final two teams are the Gold Bucks and the Black Cats. Wednesday and crew better win, I'm sorry. We're gonna shoot them out, we're gonna shoot them out! Or stab it! They're really cheating. I'm sorry, that is so unfair. Siren shouldn't be allowed to play it in a game in the water. That is so unfair. <laughs> he just fucking knocked him out. Oh my god, he better not die. Is he sirs? He ain't sirs. <laughs> he better not die. Oh wait, his, his bot is like, is, is able to be in the water, isn't he? <laughs> Fuck you, bitch! <laughs> oh, I'm so happy for them. The first poker took place in eight. We don't care about the history, hon. We don't care. Get to it. Oh, give me my prize, do you know what I mean? This is not me, she didn't give a shit about the prize. It was just beating Bianca. The last time Ophelia Hall won the Poe Cup, your mother kept in the team. I was her co-pilot. Wow. wow. I mean, to be fair, she does give very old Enid. So that, do, I, I see that. God, did, oh, did you see that? The thing really did a number on him. I'll tell you what, for just a hand, he packs a punch. Whoa, that is boots. Oh, so is this like their fucking layer for this group? 
grandmother staring at me in a judgmental way. Oh my god, her mum and dad. Were her mum and dad part of it? That's the page. But the minute I inch towards the truth, luckily, I'm not afraid of the dark. Oh, and that's the end. Fuck, okay, shit, I didn't know we were bordering on the end so, so quickly, fucking hell. So someone's just kidnapped her. God. Well, guys, luckily enough, I think the next video you'll get is probably episode three of this. I'm, I might film it maybe later on today. But, I don't know, I'll see you then, I guess. Oh, God, the, the ending of that really snuck up on me. Like, I was ready to sit here for like another 10, 15 minutes. I did not think that was going to be the end. Bloody yeah, I wonder who's kidnapped her. Anyway, guys, that was a great episode. I'm loving this rivalry between Bianca Barclay. I really am. But I want to know... I reckon Bianca knows more than she lets on, to be honest, because it seems like she's got a real grudge. And that's it's weird to me. Although maybe it is just because, obviously, her ex shows interest in Wednesday. So maybe that's why she's got a big stick up her ass when it comes to Wednesday. But it could be that, or she might know more than she's letting on. Or that, that we know yet. Anyway, questions upon questions. Loved this episode. Hopefully you guys did too. And I'll see you soon with another rep. Bye. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Bye.